We've been tracking every new drone to hit the market for the last four years, and in this update we bought the nine best available today. Nearly 100 hours of flying later, we found the best model for every situation. Our consultations with professional drone pilots allowed us to find the most adept flyers, our in-house professional photographers and videographers helped us find the most cinematic, and our panel of newbie pilots revealed the most user-friendly. Whether you're an experienced aerial videographer or a new pilot, our testing results will guide you to the right model. The first product on our list is DJI Mavic 2 Pro. Gone are the days when you had to choose between high-end video quality or having a drone that could fit into a backpack. The DJI Mavic 2 Pro somehow manages to fit a Hasselblad camera with a 1-inch sensor into a body that folds up to the size of a large water bottle and weighs just 2 pounds. This results in a drone that can hide away when you don't need it but can quickly provide incredibly crisp and vibrant 4K video when you reach your shooting location. It makes no sacrifices in flight performance and has many intelligent flight modes to choose from, maxing out at an impressive 45 miles per hour and providing a flight time of up to 31 minutes. Price is the only downside we've found to this drone, it requires quite an investment. Otherwise, it is as good or better than every other consumer model we've seen on the market. Sure, the Mavic Air is a bit more portable, and the Mavic 2 Zoom offers optical zoom, but both models are clear steps down when it comes to video quality. The Mavic 2 Pro is a clear choice for those looking for the best possible drone footage in a package that you can take with you pretty much anywhere. The second product on our list is DJI Mavic Air. The average drone user is looking for something that provides good video quality and is small and portable enough to tote along on trips, even if they're not sure they'll be flying. Ideally, it can meet these requirements while keeping the price below four digits. The DJI Mavic Air is one model we found that checks all of these boxes. The 4K camera can capture footage that looks clear and bright with good color accuracy, the battery offers a maximum flight time of 21 minutes, and it folds into a burrito-sized package that weighs slightly less than a pound. Plus, you get all this for a relatively reasonable price. This combination makes it the only 4K drone that we have no reservations about tossing into a pack no matter where we're going. Only when compared to the expensive high-end models do you notice shortcomings in the Mavic Air. These devices, like the Mavic 2 Pro, have better cameras that produce better color profiles and can generally fly for 30 minutes or more. However, those benefits are relatively small when you consider you'll be paying close to twice as much. For most people, we think the Mavic Air can get all the shots you want without weighing you down or hurting your wallet too much. The next product in our list is DJI Mavic Mini. Filling a near-perfect niche for beginner pilots, the DJI Mavic Mini produces a good enough video to satisfy creative urges while sporting a reasonable price tag for those looking to take a shot at a new hobby. And because it's incredibly small and portable, there's a better chance that you'll have it in your backpack or purse when the urge to take some aerial video strikes. The Mini uses the DJI Fly app, a streamlined and intuitive interface that makes it very easy for novice pilots to get up in the air and start taking great video. The latest version of this app includes a firmware update that allows for more fine-tuned control of video settings, namely manual white balance and exposure controls. To keep the Mini true to its name, it's clear that DJI made some sacrifices, like the significant omission of obstacle avoidance sensors. It also lacks the 4K resolution that is quickly becoming standard. Despite its shortcomings, we still think the Mavic Mini can serve as a near-perfect introduction to the aerial videography game. The next product is Rise Tello. The Rise Tello is the only model we've found that still flies with some semblance of stability and slides in at an affordable price. Most models in this price range don't have any sort of flight sensors, with even the slightest bit of overzealousness sending them careening into a crash. Thus, it can take the skill and patience of a Jedi Master to keep them steady. On the other hand, the Tello sports some DJI flight sensing technology, making a stable hover its center point and maneuvering out of that hover very easy and intuitive. 
This allows for a much more fun and less frustrating flying experience for kids and can be a good introduction for adult novices who want to get a feel for flying before putting a much more expensive camera drone in the air. Video quality is the Tello's biggest flaw, which comes across as grainy and often drops frames, resulting in odd cuts and jumps in the footage. However, the quality still far outstrips what most comparably priced models can produce. Additionally, the Tello is controlled via virtual joysticks on your mobile device's touchscreen, which is just not as fun as using real joysticks. This problem can be easily rectified with a compatible third-party Bluetooth gaming controller. Bottom line, we think this is the inexpensive model that is least likely to be flown into a wall right after opening the box, and it's the one that kids will enjoy the most. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.